Hello, brothers and sisters. I'm still in Psalm 88. I'd like to read to you two simple verses. It says, You have put in the depth, you have put me in the depth of the pit, in the regions dark and deep. Your wrath lies heavy upon me, and you overwhelm me with all your waves. Did you notice how many times it says that God did this? It's popular in certain Christian circles to say God never afflicts anybody. God speaks way differently throughout the Bible. In the Hebrews, it talks about the discipline of the Lord. The problem is we misunderstand. We think that when God's wrath comes upon us, like it says here, heavy, or he disciplines us, that it's punishment because we're disobedient. But that's not the, the meaning of this word. The very idea is more of, of training in righteousness. It's a potter working with the clay he has to make it into what he wants it. And for us, it's to make us like Christ. It is painful, it's difficult, but it's always out of love and goodness, not because we are evil. It's to because he wants to make us like Christ. But yes, the Lord will be the one putting his heavy hand upon us to do that sometimes. To press certain things out of us, to change a few things that need to be changed, to challenge things in our lives, our thoughts and our hearts that need to be challenged through suffering. It is of God or for our greatest good. That's why it says in Romans that all things work together for our good, for those who are called by him, those who are loved by him, because the good is that God is trying to do is to make us more like Christ. So again, discipline, God's hand being heaven on us, same thing. It's God working us in the image of his son. Let's not shy away from what God himself has said, but instead say it is good what God has done.